What up, YouTube? This is Sneed from Sneed Mobile Tech, and I just have a quick video for you guys tonight. T-Mobile is rolling out the LTU technology uh, that they've been, um, I guess, kind of previewing. They've been uh, kind of making a big deal about it. It's it's nothing uh, revolutionary, but it is going to be a huge improvement in speeds in some of the you know key areas, I guess, in the U.S. Uh, where they have certain types of spectrum available for use. Uh, so let's get into some of the details. So what they're calling LTEU is basically an unlicensed band of spectrum that T-Mobile has obtained. Uh, it's previously hasn't been used or uh, utilized by T-Mobile, so this is new to them. Uh, but what they're doing with this um, this unlicensed spectrum is they're basically going to take um, the five gigahertz band of spectrum and achieve some really really high speeds and what's kind of cool about this the speeds that we're going to see is theoretically we're supposed to see speeds of about 750 megabits per second on the download which is fantastic that's almost gigabit speed so this being available before 5g deployment kind of sets it up for you know a, a nice step in that direction uh, there are some restrictions to this technology though uh, the key areas where you might see it would be Bellevue, Washington, Brooklyn, New York, Dearborn, Michigan, Las Vegas, Nevada, Richardson, Texas, or Simi Valley, California. And there's only one class of devices that can do this. It's the uh, Samsung Galaxy S8 and S8 Plus. I'm guessing it's a processor restriction. Uh, so, you know, those having the Snapdragon 835, as well as probably a couple other um, restrictions. But, um, yeah, those are the devices that are compatible with it. And those are the markets that will be, I guess, kind of piloting the technology. So uh, this is kind of cool. I'm, I'm really glad to see it. You know, T-Mobile's been a disruptor for a few years now. They've been really making a lot of noise. And this is a good step in the right direction to put pressure on other carriers to have to step up their game, improve speeds across the nation, and, and have them investing in their network. So good job by T-Mobile. Hopefully some people can start testing in those areas to see if we're getting those theoretical speeds of about 750 megabits per second on the download. I'd love to hear from you guys. If you're in that area and you have those devices, you know, let us know what you're seeing on your speed test. If you can confirm those are the things that you're able to, to kind of get your devices to show. So, um, yeah, we'll see if, if, you know, the speeds actually do hit that point and, uh, if it's true and we'll see what we get. Uh, thanks for watching the video, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.